I need that. It's important. How do I get there again? He's perfectly fine. I'm just like, hi? There's a another one of you? Oh, Oh, Jesus. Oh, Jesus. No, 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 no! Putrid, stinky, 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 stinky! That is so big! I have a really broad definition of hints in this chat. You want to know why? Because people often think they're cleverer than they are. Let me be real with you. She'll never know what I mean if I write P.O.P. instead of Path of Pain. She'll have no idea what that means. There's no way she could figure out an acronym that many people have said in chat. There's no way! It's impossible! Says the chatter first time there. Meanwhile, I've seen Path of Pain 80 billion times. What is this? Don't tell me. Rhetorical. Rhetorical! Oh, balls! That was rude! I'm alive? Oh. Well, that was a roller coaster. I'm glad you were all there with me. <laughs> well, there go my souls. I don't really care. I don't need them. You think I care about souls? There are no souls in this game. They're all called root. Ooh, what's this? There's a hole in the ceiling. Are you aware of this? Hello? Mind if I drop in? Oh. You guys are on break time. Hardest I've ever seen anyone get wrecked. It was pretty wrecky. What is this? Wait, what the fuck? 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 Cool. It's like real. I thought I would die a lot sooner. It's cold. Yeah, oh damn. Wait a second, what if you... What if you- what if you land right in the center and click the button? What if that works? Wait, what?! Whoa! Holy sh- <laughs> Let's go! God Gamer! Let's go! Speedrunners here at twitch.tv slash Rafferino. Let's f***ing go! It's not supposed to work that way? Well, it does now, baby! Woo! Let's go! I don't- I don't think I should go down there. I've never seen that. What up, gamers? You know, it's just- just built different. <laughs> There's no way that's intended. Okay, but here's the thing. I jumped down the first time and I didn't die. So... It's complete legit. Yeah! Well, now I have a secret way. But, okay, the thing is, I thought maybe it was intended. Oh my f Because I didn't die on the way down, and normally you would fall on the way down. You would take the damage. Can you stop spamming? Bitch, I have other problems. Can you go home? Okay. Seriously, stop spamming. You're so stinky. Literally, no one loves you. No! 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 God, gamer hitless. Don't! 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 Don't slam her ass down on me. I will ban you. I'll ban you from my stream. And then we hit him with the nebula. And then surprise, we hit him with another nebula. And then we people leave. Let's go! Easy game. That kill box? Yeah, but the second time there was a kill box. So why was there a kill box and then no kill box? I was confused. Wait. Why did I just get two? <laughs> a little confusion, but okay. I don't know what it counts as. Stop breaking the game. I can't! Ron Staff! I don't know if you're supposed to get two. Ceremonial staff depicting the Erd Tree in its historic radiance. It festers with scarlet rot, wielded by the avatars who protect the minor Erd Trees. Withering Erd Tree's offspring. Okay, so I got two. But definitely not supposed to get two at once. Yeah, I can't stop breaking the game at this point. You had a spare staff? You know, he do, he do be having a spare. My inventory is chaos. Thank you, I try. Hey, baby. You meditating in here? What's up?
Where's my bonk? Where's my bonk? Where's my club? Where's my club? Where's my club? My club? My club? My club? Okay, okay, okay. Alright, no, 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 wait, 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 okay, hang on. Go! Wrong button! Break him! Break. Break. Decease. Defeat. Murder. Murder. No. Stop it. Stop it. Stop it. <laughs> Hi. No. Down. Sit down. No. 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 <laughs> this is intended. No. Go to horny jail. <laughs> I have never bullied a Crystallian harder and I have no regrets. Alright, anyway. And then we hit him with a <laughs> oops. <laughs> Crystallians deserve it, I will not hear otherwise. Where's the hidden wall that leads to the fair lady? So I can give her 30 humanity and unlock the secret shortcut to unlock to beat Solaire. After a shiny on that bridge? Yeah, it's in the other direction, but this is a dead end. I just wanted to explore. Yeah, you're so impatient. You think I forget? And I do sometimes, but I often don't forget, is the thing. So sometimes I forget, but sometimes I don't. I never forget, unless I do. Wait, is there only one? And he's just patrolling? Oh shit, there is only one. Hi! Somber Ancient Dragon Smithing Stone. Sick, thank you. So, I want to see what's at the secret. Oh, look at that! It's probably that! It's probably that, dude! I can go down there. Because I found a secret shortcut. It's not a secret, it's a she's. Shh! It's a secret. How do- can I- can I- We? Oh, look, a tree! What does this lead? Oh, <gasps> shiny! Old enough to not get carded liquor store, I have zero fear. I get carded like most of the time and I'm like, really? I don't look... I look 19 to you? We're all 18? We're all above 18 and under... Actually, I have to be 18 to be in my chat because I have like mature... Mature rating. So uh, everyone here is above 18. Oh, <gasps> shiny. Wait, did I not grab this shiny? What? Sacred crown helm? What? Oh, it's a draw from a person? Did I get your cool hat? Say it's not very mature in here? <laughs> what do you mean? Yeah, you're right though. Palladry helm! Wow. Dude, am I hacking? What are these drop rates right now? What the fuck? Have people pull up? Yeah, you gotta, you gotta show me the ID chat. Also, what's your uh, mom's maiden name and the last digits of your social security number? I'm, I'm joking. I, I'm not asking for that. Please don't post that or share that or tell me. Halic Tree Helm. Helm worn by soldiers sworn to the Halic Tree. An iron helm graced by a crown of unalloyed gold increases fate. That sounds strong as hell, question mark? Oh. <laughs> Looks so goobery. Oh! New lore! Look at this! Flanged iron cap adorned with a crown of unalloyed gold increases faith. Worn by foot soldiers sworn to the hallowed tree. Who is it that Nicola shall bless if not the low and the meek? Ooh. Fascinating lore. Real unalloyed gold about as hard as frozen butter. Yeah, uh, gold is incredibly bendable. One of the most malleable soft metals. What hat was I wearing again? I don't remember. How about speaking lower loud but you speak fast? That's definitely always true. I'm a very fast talker. I think that's why I have a stutter sometimes, is I literally talk faster than I can keep up with. What hat was I wearing? Oh my god. Oh right, the hood. I don't like this one as much. It's 
her a bunch. It's a bitch to unlearn. I don't know how to unlearn it at this point. It's too late for me. Too late. This is new. Okay, that was rude. Oh, a shiny. What really sucks is that was news. Like, I hadn't been there before. Oh Jesus! Oh no! Yep, shouldn't aggro too. Uh, it's okay. I don't. I didn't need my life anyway. I just wanted to see what was over there. Mouth faster than brain syndrome. Yep, most definitely. You know, I should use healing spells on them, but I don't have any healing spells, like revenants, because we got lots of them. True. They're really scary, but what's really cool about them is if you heal them, they take damage because they're cursed. I got that from a- Oh my fuck! Hello? <laughs> okay, I slept on the exploding boys. It turns out they explode. Wait, is this entertainment free? It do be free! Except for if you want to enter your credit card information to Twitch.tv legally and fairly and goodly, then you could subscribe. And support or if you have twitch prime hey do you know that if you have twitch prime you are entitled to one free anyway sorry listen i was memeing okay <laughs> so 60 bigger treating you um it turns out like many people uh i feel i'm weak to to getting blown up of course I like the smile because it scares me a little bit. Ow! What the fuck, actually? Push me down the stairs? Do I look like your little brother? Do I look like... Yeah, I'm gonna push you down the fucking stairs now, bitch. You like that? You like that? You like your fucking corpse rolling down the fucking stairs, idiot? Fucking dumbass. Fucking dumbass? <clears throat> Oh, fuck. Oh, Jesus. Oh, God. You know, this is because I said this area felt easy when you first walked in, isn't it? Isn't it? Ow! Please stop! Ow! Ow, no! No, you can't come out here. Mom said it's my turn on the balcony. Jesus Christmas. <laughs> Panic roll. I'm dead. No! I gambled with a nebula. I still remember people complaining about... Like, I still remember that, like, article or something I read. It was just a shit take, but I'm still... I'm, it's gonna live rent-free in my mind forever. Someone writing that the Elden Ring's open world is too big and too detailed, and it's exhausting. And they don't like it because it's too detailed and too exhausting, and it makes them tired, and they would like to, to... You know, I don't know what they want, I guess. Smaller fucking worlds? And I was like, how dare you? How fucking dare you? How? How? Oh, maybe you descend to Odin Chapel. I don't really wish there were fewer bosses. Maybe. I think we're playing like 100 hours deep, but that's the thing. That's literally was my response. Was just, just take a break for it. Like, I'm not trying to be dismissive, but the only thing that I could get from the fucking article, seriously, was, well, I would like the game to be smaller. And you know what happens when we want games to be smaller? Game studios are like, people don't want innovation. They don't want content. They want easy, cookie cutter, brain off games. And is there anything wrong with that every once in a while? No, because you know what you get with a cookie cutter? You get a well-shaped cookie. And sometimes it's nice to have a well-shaped cookie experience. But sometimes you want a little bit of innovation. 
And the whole, the whole point of the article seemed to be, hey, I would like more cookie cutters, but I never want anything to break the mold. And I was like, how fucking dare you? How fucking dare you? Because a game dev is gonna read that and be like, oh, guess I don't need to do anything new. Sick. Like, good god. Oh! That's a big boy. <laughs> only bitch I trust, only bitch I trust, only bitch I trust! Go, 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 only bitch I trust! Ah, shit! I wasn't expecting the Erdtree Avatar Inquisition, okay? But that's the thing, is that no one expects it. Like, I guess, I really don't know. I wonder, like, maybe it was just, like, an attempt to, like, clickbait or whatever. But I'm sorry. Complaining about too much content in a game is just, is like, is like... Ugh. What's this like? It's just, it's just like... Man... I have too much to play. Huh. Like, yeah, sometimes we all feel like that because we don't have enough time or whatever. And then you just take your time. I don't know. Same cookie since 2007, just put out different colors on the meat sure to trick us into thinking they're new. And sometimes it's fun to have a nice, comforting cookie that tastes exactly the same and you know exactly what to expect from that cookie. Hi? Look at this pond! It's pretty! Hi? Shh. Die quietly. We're doing a 100% stealth pacifist playthrough. It kind of, it would, you know what, it's a good analogy, dude. Making people want to not engage with content is bad design, though, but, like, what's an example of that? Because, like, as far as, like, I, this, this article that I'm talking about was specifically talking about how the areas are so detailed that they're getting fatigued of exploring. And I'm like, then take a break, forehead. Because the only thing that I could think of that they're complaining about is that the worlds are too big and too detailed and they would like them to be smaller. And that ain't good. Fatigued or bored? Fatigued. That's the thing. Right? Yo! Clear on knife and lay! What? Acquire a legendary extra maze chat! I did it! I did all the actions! Let's fucking go! Whomst are you? Legendary Ashen Remains used to summon the spirit of the Clean Rot Knight Finlay. Finlay was one of the few survivors of the Battle of Aeonia who, in an unimaginable act of heroism, carried the slumbering demigod Melania all the way back to the Halic. She managed the feat alone, fending off all manner of foes along the way. <gasps> I ship it like FedEx. I love it. I love her. I guess it's Finley, but I keep saying Finlay because I I'm when I see things written down, sometimes I say them weirder than normal. <laughs> um, but yeah, no, like it's totally fine. Like to to, like I'm not talking about bosses though. Just to clarify, like the repetitive bosses is one thing. I just want to clarify that I'm talking very specifically about the fact someone's complaining about the open world being big and detailed. And I was like, please don't do that. Please don't write articles like that. I'm sorry, because that's just going to give developers an excuse. They don't even need one. They really don't. But they're still like, I guess it doesn't even matter at that point. But it just came off very weird, like really weird. That's all. Shipping them? Shipping them like FedEx? Yeah, I say that all the time at this point. <laughs> I've shipped so many people like FedEx. Complaining about the game being too big is basically just complaining about the fact they love their game. Yeah, that's a little bit of one that I do not appreciate. Because I guess it's just like... I don't know, if you're tired of exploring, take a break. That's literally it. That's literally it. Okay, this seems like an important chest because it's got a golden in it. Another one. Dude, I've gotten two somber ancient dragon smithy stones in like two minutes. I'm upset when a game is complete, has a lot of content at launch. And that's the thing. Realistically, girls, this game was not complete on release. It ha there's tons of things to criticize for incompleteness. Um, really, like, literal quest lines that are, like, half at half in the game. Um, stuff like that. 
Arcane being broken. You want to know what's funny about the a seedbed curse? Oh my gosh, I found another one. Oh, that's huge. Yeah, so the funny thing about Arcane Chat, okay, this is... So I don't have all the details, um... Because I don't really necessarily remember. But funny story about Arcane is that when the game in in the in the pre-release version of the game that a bunch of streamers got to play, not me, but like other streamers, um, Arcane apparently there were no weapons that scaled with Arcane, and they switched it for the release like the day one patch or like the release patch or whatever. Um, so basically, they were planning on doing something, and they changed it last minute, and they broke something else, which is just really bad because that's what they did with Radon. And Meow, I think you mentioned this, but basically the fact that they broke Radon, then they fixed Radon because they didn't mean to nerf Radon the way that they did. They meant to lower his hitboxes, change his hitboxes, but not lower his damage. But they lowered his damage, which means they didn't play test it because someone would have found that out, right? In other words, it's just really sussy. So the arcane thing, it's its even more complicated than that. It's like they changed it last minute, but didn't test it right. Bob and a weave. Bob and a weave. Bob and a weave. The wind-up was so long. What? Oh, there's- I didn't see the archeries up there, that's my bad. They claim they didn't? Yeah, it's a little bit sussy. I- yeah, it must have been one of those dinguses up there. I didn't see the archers up there on the side. Whee! Oh. Cool. Hey, what's this? How do I get there? Did I pick up a weapon that I didn't read? I didn't mean to do that, but that's okay. I want to go take the seedbed curse uh, to the guy, Dung Eater, because that's a big one. That's a big one. Um, this will be the fifth, and what is the significance of that? Nothing. But I just, I just feel like it's a good number. Maybe this time something will happen, Copium. You know, I think it's a major Copium situation. <laughs> But it could also be a thing. I don't know. <laughs> On check for more glitches? Yeah, I'm so proud that I did that. It's so dumb. I'm glad I found that. So it definitely wasn't the intended way. But uh, at the same time... I'm so tempted to see what's down there just because I love sequence breaking, but I'm also scared. Is some people be full of cur curses copium? Definitely. So much copium. Hi, Dung Eater! I made it. Use the seed bed curse. This is the fifth one. Say that before. I think five is a magic number chat. Might not have been a copium. What? What? Quit! Quit! Eureka! Eureka! I actually get it now. Receive mending rune. Mending rune of the fell curse. I get it now. I fucking get it. Oh no. Okay, so you know how we got. Oh no, chat. I thought there was only one mending rune. There is not one mending rune. There's many mending runes. I might say there's mending of them. It's stupid. I'm sorry. I'm just excited, okay? I've fallen a little back into pun meta today. I, I can't help it. I'm excited. Loathsome rune adjusted by the dung eater. Pregnant? <laughs> Man pregnant? <laughs> what? <laughs> <laughs> Mending rune of the fell curse. Look at how fucked up it looks. Loathsome rune gestated by the dung eater. Used to rest. <laughs> Sorry. 
<laughs> Just taken by the dog eater. This man's literally fucking god. All right, sorry. Uh. <clears throat> this is very serious lore. Respectfully, this is very serious lore. So we have to talk about this seriously. <laughs> you know when you see, you know when you eat too much, and people are like, "I got a food baby." This man literally just had a food baby. <laughs> Gonna reap what you sow, and he sure did sow a lot of seed bed curses. You know what I'm saying? This is highly uncomfortable. Everything about this is really uncomfortable, I gotta tell you. Alright, <clears throat> alright, <clears throat> this is really serious though, okay? Loathsome rune gestated by the Dung Eater, used to restore the fractured Elden Ring when brandished by the Elden Lord. The reviled curse will last eternally, and the world's children, grandchildren, and every generation hence will be its pustules. If order is defiled entirely, defilement is a defilement no more, and for every curse, a cursed blessing. <laughs> I can't believe I kept it together, to be honest with you. Yeah, he's fucked. <laughs> yeah, dude, I need to... God, now I'm tempted to do a... Remember what I did for Sekiro? Because I didn't want to play it four times. No offense, Sekiro, I, I love you, but I, I didn't want to play you four times. How I reloaded my save. And like, you know. I kind of want to do that because I don't want to have to do this shit again. I just want to see the endings. I'm tempted. I'm tempted. Kill him now. My man's is dead. We'll come back. We'll go visit. See what's up with him. He might not be dead dead. He might be like out. We'll come back. I can cross Dong Eater off the list. <laughs> Bitch, bye. Play. No, I'm gonna play it again. I'm just really impatient. <laughs> I'm excited. Like, I did like two two of these quest lines, and this one was kind of tough, honestly. So I'm gonna play through it again, it's just like I'm really tempted because I'm just like having a good time, but... You know, I, I do wanna- I, I probably will not do that. I know. I'll- I'll just play through it again. I'm gonna be playing this game for a long time. Let's go! Your outfit? His outfit. Omen armor. Let's go. Exactly what I was hoping for. Alright. Omen helm. Malformed helm resembling an omen with his horns cut off. Worn by the dung eater, its form is a vision of the landscape of his mind and of his appearance as he wished to see it. The heart of an omen without the body to match. Could there be any crueler existence? What does it matter then? What does it matter then if the curse claims it all? So he's cosplaying as an omen because he's not an omen, so he curses other people? The heavy, sun-shaped medallion represents both the guidance he once saw and the ring to which it will one day lead. What? Uh, are those- are those pustules or teeth? They're horns! Cut off horns. A lot of the omen have them, but they, I think the fact that they look like pustules or suckers, like on a tentacle, is intended. Um... Is he Solaire? No. I, I'm not one of the people who links the game th the game lores, but I think it's interesting that they gave him a sun medallion. Really, such a fucked up character. I think it's it's pretty interesting. Also, I'm not gonna I'm not gonna reload the save to get the multiple endings. I was just tempted because it's just it's it's tempting because I wanted I want to get all the answers right, but at the same time, it's it's definitely better to commit and pick. It's just like when you when you make a decision for a quest, you gotta pick and commit. Because that's part of the charm of this game. So even though I'm tempted to do that, like, save and reload, I'm not going to do it. Because it's... I don't know. It's unfair. It's it's perfectly fair if you want to do it, just to be clear. But for me personally and how I want to play, I don't want to give myself that option. You know what I mean? Will goat armor Havel? Yeah, bull goat is, is definitely... I think it's about Havel. Uh-huh. Wow, it's kind of weird. There are two seedbed curses in... Two in Lane Dell, I think, and two in uh, the Halleck Tree. Very strange place for them to be, huh? Really, if you think about it? 
I should go talk to Gowry. I'm trying to talk to him after each major Millicent progression. And the fact that she's telling us more of her information seems interesting. Let's go! He actually has information! Look! Oh my god, I love this. This is this is why. This is why I double check, because oh, let's go. What Millicent said. Oh, Millicent. Finding herself, is she? The words of a true innocent, the dear girl. Well, perhaps this is just as it should be. Little Millicent following in the steps of her mother, no matter what. This is their fate, after all. A little bit messed up. So, Millicent, he says that he, she's following the steps of her mother, which is quite possibly... It's hinted at being Melania, and it's backed up by the fact that Millicent says that she thinks she is of Melania's kin. But how do we know that she's right, right? Um, we, we can't be sure, really. We, she could be real. And, and know what she's talking about. I initially thought that the mother thing was like Scarlet Rot. That the Scarlet Rot is some sort of... Well, at first I thought it was a disease, but then Millicent said that... That Melania could resist the will of the Scarlet Rot. Something along those lines. Something I must the will that was a dignity. Allowed her to resist the call. Herself. And to resist the call, that means that she would have been... Um... Whoa! Tempted! And it almost suggests that it has like a like a strength to it, kind of like beast blood in Bloodborne, right? Something that you have to resist, and you need a sense of self and, and will to do that, and she gave that up. How Millicent is gonna return it, I don't know. But we do know we know a couple of things about Millicent though. I think she's like a sport. Could be. One interesting thing, though, about Millicent is that she invades us when we go to the heart of Aeonia in her, like, damaged form. She does invade us, and then we, def we I guess we defeat her. I don't know if that's canon, but we, we do. We fight O'Neill, we get the, the needle, we bring it to Millicent, and then she changes her whole look up and seems to retain some sort of sentience, but, um... She do be invading us, so it's kind of interesting. I don't know, there's a lot of different permutations here. Not anything I can talk about fully yet, because I don't have all the pieces of information. But I'm very, very engaged by this quest line, so I'm really trying. I'm glad I went back for Millicent. Oh my god, I still can't believe I found her so easily. Like, Jesus. Easier than I thought it would be, anyway. I don't remember invading you either. Yeah! It probably wasn't her, it was probably the Scarlet Rot trying to protect itself, maybe? So the Scarlet Rot does appear to have a will? Very much like the Beast Curse, how it spreads, how it changes the terrain. Um, like the, the, the fact that it affects everything around it. Scarlet Rot does seem to have a lot of links to the Beast Curse, which is interesting considering I'm linking Melania and Maria already. More M names! <laughs> She doesn't remember him? Yeah, no, one of the signs of Scarlet Rot is a uh, loss of memory. Apparently. Most of the bosses are with GRM? I did. I tweeted about it, chat. Chat, I tweeted about that. Son of a! No, that was a targeted assassination of my health bar. Son of a bitch! I was the origin of that theory. Yeah, no, I'm sure lots of people thought it, but like it just, I, I tweeted about it and like 20 people liked it versus, you know, someone wrote an article about it and everyone hears it, but even though I thought of it first, you know. <laughs> you know who's the first person to think of that? GRM himself. Old George debunked that? You think I give a shit what he says? Whoops, I didn't do with that. <laughs> Oh god, I forgot. I love the Halo Tree damage spike. It do be hurting over here. Uh huh. Fucking dare you, bitch. Wait a second. People leave. Excuse me, sir. Pardon. D accident. Goodbye. Goodbye, sir. S bye, sir. Sir, bye.
They need to hide initials? Uh, I argue that he didn't hide them at all. It's true. Maybe lose his memory after Malachith caused by something else then? Uh, he's a misbegotten. I don't know quite enough about the misbegotten yet to really conclude. Um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know. But yeah, okay. So the Gwyn thing, if anything, is a source of character development because it shows that Gwyn's a, a fucking asshole who names people after himself uh, because everyone must be an extension of his will, right? So that's like an easy thing to talk about. The Quay sisters... Um, we know of... Unless I'm forgetting, do we only know of two that have the same name? Quaylog and Quailana? Are there others? Like, yeah, there's there's definitely an intent there. Um, but like, yeah, for sure. I think the difference here is that they all start with the same damn letters. Know what I mean? That's the secret. Okay, I, I've, I hear that beetle up there, and I want it, even though it's just a stupid beetle. It's a stupid beetle. It's a blue beetle. No one cares about the beetle, but I want it anyway. Power teacher in the swamp? Quailana. So, like, but here we got Melania, Marika, Mel Melisent, you know? Like, they're just, like, similar because they're... Oh, but they're all family, actually! Yeah, I get it, but, like, fuck off, dude. I'd rather you just name them all John the 1st, 2nd, 3rd, 4th, 5th at this point. Jesus. Make it easier, almost. Gosh darn it. Golly gee willikers. Here we go. Halitree Soldier Ashes. Spirits of common soldiers who carry the sacred light. When weakened, they explode to deliver a last-ditch attack. Or they'll just start with it and fuck your shit up, by the way. This was the bitter- this was the bitter revelation discovered by the desperate soldiers who awaited the return of their lord to the rotted hallig tree. May the flash of our deaths guide Nicola's return. Aww. They want their lord to come back. Godfrey, Godfrey, Godric, some similar names. I could even buy the god names. That's- oh, fuck off. Why did I do that? I just wanted to explore, though. Uh-oh. I think it comes from one of the other terms commonly used for chicken. Or, not chicken. For that, for a rooster. Uh, and I'm not talking about nuggets. You know, I'm not talking about chicken nuggets. What's up here? Oh, damn. Look at this stained glass. Oh, Halid Tree Night Helm. That looks sick. Helm worn by knights sworn to the Halid Tree. Graced by a crown of unalloyed gold increases faith and kind of makes you look like a dingus. This is ruined sentinel as hell. Hen, yeah, I meant hen, exactly. Thank you for understanding what I meant. Oh, damn. Dude, I knew there had to be a friggin' bonfire coming up because, like, I've been- I've been running. Super tall head wrap. Did you grow it yourself? Yeah, it, it fits my big brain. It's very narrow, though. I don't know- <laughs> I don't know if I want to say that. I don't even mind narrow helmet designs. That one looks a little excessive, though. It's very... Ruined Sentinels. So now I can take this dingus out faster. That was rude. 
The fog? You're tanky as hell! What the fuck? Give me one of these. Turn next to the Trigon vibe? Damn, really? Um, ow? Oh god! Oh god! Oh god! I didn't think you would make it that around the corner. Oh god! Excuse me, sir. Oh! I've always wanted to be a Trigon. Did you just heal you, sneaky self of Oh, you're a big knight. I was- I thought you were just a dingus, but you're a big knight. Ow! You got the hat that I stole. Are you another big knight? Okay. Okay, these guys hurt so much. Like, so much. Get Nebula, dinguses. Don't heal, you asshole! Oh my god. No, 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 fuck. Oh, ow. <laughs> Sarah sucks, love the lore, and look, but playing through it sucks. I actually, okay, so far, I know I just started the little elf IL, but I really like it so far. News too late before it happened, yeah. I got freaking Omea wo ma shinde rude. I said it all wrong. I can't say that sentence, okay? I, I know I, I pronounce it badly, but like, I also just can't say it in my defense, okay? Can you leave me? No. I got, I, put, I got put in the closet. They put me in the closet. Look at this. They just stuck me into a fucking locker like it's high school. What the fuck? You should level Vigor. If you had 100 Vigor, you wouldn't have died. Yeah, but leveling Vigor is also easy mode, and you should feel ashamed if you do it also, by the way. Oh, for fuck's sakes. Oh, for fuck's sakes! No! He was dead! Your brother was dead! Ah! <laughs> Dude, they're actually pulling me. Get wrecked, nerd? You'll see. You know, if you have a fucking sibling, then I'm gonna bring the only bitch I trust, alright? I'm gonna fucking- you ready? We're gonna- we're gonna tag team this shit. You ready? Get him. Get him. Get him. No, come back! No, no, come back! No, no, come back! Let me tear! Good girl! Let's go! I didn't mean to do that. It's okay. It's fine. Everything's fine. Everything's fine. Everything's good. We're good. I can't stand these orange team in slow clothes. Get freaking bomb, dingus loser! How you doing over there? Doing good? Where are you going? I'm fine. See that jump attack? That's how you know she's me. That's right, get him. Oh no, don't aggro. Oh right, I killed those guys. But they're gonna respawn. Wait, I'm confused. Oh, let's go! Alright, maybe here. Will we defeat him? We must teabag. You ready? Okay, teabag with me. Teabag with me. Teabag with me! She's not a perfect copy. This is how you know she's a clone. <laughs> Can't say these Ornstein and Smoke clones. I know, right? Oh my god. Oh, Jesus! She's more mature? Honestly, probably true. Is she lore walk? That's also disrespectful? True, we do love to see a lore walk. She's gonna redeem. No, goodbye. Sister. New Turing test for not, not the teabag? Well, at least I can confirm that uh, everyone that I face 
in PvP is at least human. Thanos snapping your own child. Oh, you hear that echo? What's not that? Oof. Wish Mimits here did emotes. I wish anybody in this game did emotes. <gasps> That's mean. Summons and no-hit runs? I know nothing about no-hit runs. Everything I know about no-hit runs is nothing. Okay, fuck off! How, how about- how about- hey, hey, we talk about- it. I have an idea? Uh, how about- I hate crystallians. I hate them. I hate them a lot. Everything here is rotten. I know they were listening. Yeah, they didn't like my idea. Rock crystal sword! Cool, wait. Interesting. Is that a- wait, I gotta look at that. That sounds interesting. Okay, bye. Goodbye. Goodbye. Ooh. <gasps> well, look at the Michaelis lilies. They're not Michaelis lilies. They're different. These are the. These are like the lily. Hang on. These are a real. Aren't they called calla lilies? I swear they're called calla lilies. I swear. I think they are. And if they're calla lilies, then that's there's lilies here. I don't need to kill them. Is the thing. Because I got what I needed. What, what am I gonna do? Murder them? Who cares? They're stupid crystallians. I will fucking teabag them anytime. But I think they're real they're real flowers, those things. So it's interesting to see them, but they're kinda different. Interesting. 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 Because both um Hang on, let's take a look. Oh! I thought that there was... What's interesting is that the early flower is also a lily. Oh, my lights went off. Oops. But yeah, so this is not a lily, but it is a lily. Um, this is, li like, this is a real lily, and, and if this were a real flower, it would be a lily. Um, kind of reminiscent of a tiger lily, but not quite, obviously. A little bit more like a fire pattern. Uh, then we have Trina's lily. We have Mikola's lily. Really interesting. So Trina also has a lily. That's interesting to think about, now that I think about it. Uh, right, and then, um... Lord's Rune! No, I have this already. Yeah, no, already got these. Yep. Yep, yep. I thought maybe I got a new one. I know it tells you when you get a new item, but most of the time I just click X. Oh wait, the new sword! That too. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where are you at? Probably near the top, because you're a sword. Ah, it's probably not very good. I did use the crystal sword for a little while. Um, didn't really like it. But it does do Scarlet Rot. And it's int scaling, which is really interesting. Like, it's the same as the other one. Need impossible for a human and wreath with powerful magic. Its attack scales with intelligence. Ooh, fancy. Look, I remembered. I know. These are beautiful. They're like... I think it's probably the light, but they are pink-tinged. <gasps> oh, that looks nasty. Like, beautiful, but also nasty. This is gorgeous. So, what's really interesting here is that Elphiel, uh, I don't know if I mentioned this or talked about this before, I don't think I did, but it's called the Brace of the Hallow Tree. Butterfly, pink butterfly, gimme, 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 I want you, I want you, I want you, I want you, please. You're my best friend. I love pink. I love butterflies. Oh, it's my new favorite. Butterfly. Butterfly. Okay, uh, sorry. <laughs> oh, pest! Oh dear god. 
these look like a like cherry blossoms. They're obviously not because they're growing from the ground, but the 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 five petaled thing? Yeah. Lead Ash of War on that and do blood and rot? Probably. I'm obsessed with this area. I I don't think we've seen coloration like this. Sorry, okay. Elphiel is the brace of the Halog tree. So this is a city that was built because like it, it looks like the tree is all damaged on the inside. So it's literally in the wall of the tree to help keep it up and help it survive. Pretty interesting. Yeah, I figured this would be Scarlet Rot. Oh, it's thick. Scarlet Rot too. I don't know if we're gonna live. Yep, yep. Ah, yep, yep. Um, I have a plan. <laughs> to do a cat distracted by shinies. Butterflies! Not just any shinies, but pink, glowy butterflies. How can you blame me, am I right? Uh, but yeah, no, we're gonna use Bloodhound Sep to get through this, but like, maybe we do wanna just throw some rocks at this motherfucker. Good plan. Your nebula build? I am a nebula build. I don't know why I bothered pretending to be anything else. So these guys really suck, and now they- no. And now they have damage scaling. It's got here 20 minutes ago? Well, you have beautiful timing. You wanna know why? It's always a good time to be here. That's my secret cap. It's always a good time to come in. No matter what, no matter what time when someone says, oh, hey, like I made it on time or I'm right on time for this or whatever. I'm like, you picked a good time. Yeah, this motherfucker can pick a good time to die though. If you ask me. 31,000 souls for that guy, by the way. Holy shit. For that one enemy with the golden eyes. Because he had golden eyes, just to clarify. I know. He had golden eyes, or I know. I'm just saying. Bloodhound step. Bloodhound step. What area is this? Uh, you know what? Excuse me, there appears to be a dingus in the water? Why don't anyone tell me there's a dingus in the water? What kind of dingus is in this water? Yeah, we're in the hallig tree right now. Um... What the f- are those? Unbelievable. That's the wrong button. Bye. Bye. Goodbye. What are you, by the way? What are you? Are you a baby pestilent priest? Because that's really fucked up. Ew, you are, aren't you? So this is where you're born in? That's disgusting. Like, not to king shame, but like, that's disgusting. Thank you, you're stinky and gross. Ew. Bloodhound Sep, get me the fuck out of here. <laughs> this thick juice has no power over me! I do like how they sit with their ass in the air, it's fucking weird. You find the Michaela too? Yeah, I think I repressed that. So, a couple of things. Um... Holy, oh my god, what the fuck. That's- yeah, that's actually it. Why is it so pretty here, but also so fucked up? Oh my lord! Right. Should I? <laughs> I was like, he fell, idiot, and then I was like... I think I got possessed by the spirit of the Joker there for a minute. I don't know what else would happen. I, I honestly don't know. A big shiny. Something stinky is gonna come out of this water, I already know. I can smell it. Bitch, you think this is my first Souls game? 
You're... That was a little mean. Is it because I called you a bitch? Get over it. I call everybody a bitch. I call a literal clone of myself the only bitch I trust, okay? Get over it. God, uh... Wait, fuck, what did I pick up? I forgot already. Oh, great grave glove wart. Call me a bitch is true. I don't, I don't call chat bitch. I, although sometimes I'm talking, I'll just be like, you know, someone once said this to me and I was like, bitch, you know? Did you say that? Did you actually say bitch? Did you say it? Yeah, I said, bitch. Shout out to you if you know what I'm talking about. Spoiler, it's Key and Peel. I love Key and Peel. Long way back? What do you mean? I got Bloodhound Step. Nothing's a long way back when you got Bloodhound Step, baby. Uh, I can't help but notice that my juice keeps filling. That's a little mean. Can I not have juice filling? This is a little bit of a... This is like Lake of Rot level stinky juice. Look at it keeps going! Use soap to stop that? I will literally never use soap in my life. You wanna know why? Because I'm a fucking gamer. We don't use soap. <laughs> Where am I going? I think I just went in a big circle. I did. <laughs> Ooh! We stinky out here, yeah! Little splish splash in the raw. Exactly, we do be splishing and splashing. That's why Gamer Girl bathwater is so high selling. It's true, it's the only recorded case of, of gamers using uh, baths. Taking baths. I love taking baths, actually. Eh, no! 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 Thank you. Also, in all seriousness, well, no backseating. That's literal backseating. Uh, 1 800, did I ask? Oh shit, oh shit, oh shit. Why did I do that? I don't need my souls. I don't care about them. They're irrelevant. They're irrelevant. They're stinky. Eh, yeah. what? What? Oh, he's so big. He's so big and scary. Or a showers guy? I like both. That was just mean. Oh my god, I'm alive! For how long? Can I hit you from here and then kind of just nebula you to disease me? And that would be really sick if, if, if so. Can I just, you know, continue to... What if we, uh... Take you to the cheese factory? Are there cheese factories? There are, right? Like, you just make cheese, but you can make cheese at a factory. I think that'd be okay. Okay, so I kind of did that one to myself. Camera, uh, I need you- I need the controller drift to chill the fuck out because it's- it's a big time. So... So this is pretty fucking great, right? Don't grab me, please, god Jesus, no! Oh, oh. No, he's up here! No, go back down, go to your pit! Oh, Jesus, fuck. Oh, oh god. This is stressful. Come on, just spam it. Spam Nebula, it's all, it's all you need to do- No, no, no! Hi, can you uh, emerge from the darkness? Girl, are you blasphemous? Because I could see us killing the gods together! <laughs> Come here, baby. I got some cheese for you. It's fresh. No, really. Get, get the fuck over here. He went away! What the fuck? Toxic. At this point... <coughs> Sorry. Not only have I fought enough of these guys, like, fair and square... Uh, that I- oh shit. I don't really care about cheesing. Oh fuck. I also have cheesed them enough times that I keep finding new ways to cheese them and it makes me happy. So 
so now I'm in the juice, uh, which is exactly what I didn't want to happen because it's, you know, bad. And it's bad. And, oh! <sighs> to be fair, this one baited me. This one baited me into the juice. It was bad. It didn't mean to. Maybe I cheese here because then I can, uh. Not to worry about the edge so much. Can you get your fucking ass over here? 150 is too low. We're talking about PvP dual meta though, which has literally nothing to do with playing the game. Just FYI. Okay, I'm seeing the problem. You don't want to come close, huh, buddy? Come here. He's just fucking headbutting me! <gasps> you meta to me. Oh, you're so sweet. No. You're, you must be fucking joking. It'd be nice if you come out of the water like a bit though. Like admittedly. Will this connect, do you think? Probably will. There we go, that helps. Uh oh, that's gonna hurt. Unfortunately, I'm now officially at a nebula juice. Yeah. So we do have to kind of go into the squish juice. Fuck, that's not gonna work out very well if you get hit by anything. There we go. Not too bad at all. I was hoping you would drop something other than a golden seed, because admittedly I'm kind of done with golden seeds, but it's good to get you done. I wasn't backseating. I was just doing exactly what backseating is, but it wasn't backseating. Yeah, no, I don't know if someone's actually- Well, hello? <gasps> Wait, what? Wait, what? Wait, what? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh, God. Oh, no. Oh, dear. Oh, decisions. Oh, God. Uh, well, we gotta help her, right? Like, we gotta help her. I, I have to think about my life choices for a moment. What is that? I didn't see that. Hang on a second. There appears to be a doorway. Don't tell me there was a, a freaking thing here that I didn't see this whole time. That'd be pretty funny. Oh my god. There's a door. Chat, relax. Don't worry about it. Everything's fine. I do like it when chat freaks out, though, I'm not gonna lie. Wait, what in the... Shortcut? I'm hoping for a shortcut, honestly. Wait, what? <laughs> not a shortcut, but a new bonfire. Let's go! Let's go! Okay, I wanted to rest because I wanted juice, because, like, I don't know what's going on with Millicent, but I don't want to mess it up, right? So I wanted juice. My main thing is juice. Okay. Now, what's really cool is I, I was stubbornly trying to kill that thing because I thought there might be a path past it, but I didn't think that something like that would trigger by killing it. That's, like... I was not expecting that. That's crazy. Now that I'm looking, it does appear to be a dead end. I like that you have a choice, though. That's really interesting. And, like, they don't normally give you the choices side by side like that, you know? Oh, my fuck. My heart just got pierced. Okay. Let's see what this is. So, obviously, I am a good cleric. And we don't like the Scarlet Rot um, because it's filthy and gross, so we're gonna kill her. <laughs> Just kidding. If you believe that for even a second, you don't know me. That was your test. Did you pass? <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Nelson. Her sisters? Well, this is awkward. What did I just walk into? Is that Amy? Amy, Maureen, and Mary. Jesus Christ, she's gonna ask me. No! How many sisters is there? What in the fuck is going- Pollyanna? What kind of names is this? Oh, fuck off. This is too many. God, Millie! Holy shit! Amy, or 
as some say in the camp. Go to sleep, go to sleep. No! I almost went to sleep. She just quick step me! Get out of here. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Millie! Let's go! Grab it! Millie! What happened? Obviously, Millicent comes from a big Catholic family. I think it broke the quest. It's probably too late. It's probably- No, I have to, you have to close up. You can't save to exit. I'm an idiot. It's fine. It's probably too late. Anyway. I don't really- What cost? I don't really close up very much, so my brain didn't think of it, because it could have maybe helped, but I just saved it. Either way, we have to commit. It just happened. She just fucking- She just- She just fucking necked. And after all that work today, after all that fucking work, we fucked up on the first playthrough because she walked off the fucking edge. Oh! No, she's okay! Oh. She's fine! Hello. Thank you for lending your hand. Without your help, I could not have defeated that quartet. I feel as if I've been in your debt from beginning to end. Thank you. With your help, I was able to live as my own person. If only in passing. Oh my god. I'm writing the names down. Just for funsies. What was the fourth name? Get the prosthesis? No, I don't think so. The intended drop? But, but, okay. Is past, you can't get both rewards anymore? Cool, you could. Alright, sick. And the invasion. Okay, chat. I don't know. It's my first playthrough. I don't know what's going on. Chat, you're lying. This is what I mean. People are backseating and they're not even right. Rotten winged insignia. Wait, so blah, blah. rotten winged sword insignia. A talisman depicting a raised prosthetic blade, an honor bestowed upon the Valkyries who serve the goddess of rot. Greatly raises attack power with successive attacks. Ooh. The four sisters were born in the swamp of Aeonia and came to the Halic tree under the aegis of Gauri, and yet those buds were doomed to never blossom. Oh, the four sisters, but. Oh, only one can blossom, so we got the one that blossomed. I get it. But this is where things end. I paused to even tell you, but I took out the needle myself. Tell whoever put you up to this that if I am to flower into something other than myself, I would rather rot into nothingness as I am. Please, oh. let me pass alone. The scarlet rot writhes now. Worse than ever. Soon, I won't be more than a mound of flesh. Curse laden. What? Untouchable. I wouldn't want such a thing to bring you harm. Please, the scarlet soon. Curse laden. I wouldn't want. Okay. Bye. This is so pretty, but it's so sad. I'm really glad that we did it right, though. I'm gonna rest and come back. So, she is being described as a bloom. So hang on, hang on, let me read that again. There's some lore in that talisman. I need to go tell Gowrie about this. First, I need to go rest and reset so that I can talk to her or whatever's going on. <laughs> 